My name is Joseph Asunka. I am the Chief Executive Officer of Afrobarometer. We are gathered here um, at the getting towards the end of 2024 to plan for what is to come in 2025 for Afrobarometer. For me, for where I sit, there are three core objectives that we are looking at, the overarching objective for Afrobarometer. We do have data on citizen views and experiences across the continent and what we hope to be able to do more and more going into 2025 is to ensure that this data is available and accessible and used by policy actors and policy makers to inform decision making. My name is Alex Biga. I am Chief Operating Officer for Afrobarometer. I uh, in this position, I, I coordinate the, the operations of Afrobarometer, budgeting, funding, um, other logistics. Here we have all the Afrobarometer leaders uh, gathered to review 2024 and plan for 2025. Hi, my name is Mami Ekuya Amuachum. I work at Afrobarometer as a communications coordinator. We've looked at what has worked well for us in 2024. And so building on that going into 2025, we're looking to continue building on our digital first approach, where we want to essentially make our data really accessible to all our audiences in various forms that is easy for them to use and apply so that's one thing we're really big on hi my name is rory sang lagalake i am afrobarometer senior analyst methodologist i am mohammed najib bin saad i am data quality manager responsible for post field work one of the primary goals of the analysis unit will be to stay on the cutting edge of research and, an and analysis firstly by continuing to produce our signature um, publications and also developing new ones such as country scorecards and then secondly by looking towards internal analysis of our own data through introduction of a new series the methods notes and also by having a technical review committee to look at the different issues from data perspective we will be assisting national partners and training them on uh, doing data monitoring and data cleaning. In addition to that, we will try to improve uh, producing data sets on time and also uh, automation of uh, data uh, finalization and documentation. My name is Newton Yao Noviu. I work with Afrobarometer as the Monitoring, Evaluation and Learning Manager. For 2025, we will be providing the needed support for all the various units uh, that work within Afrobarometer. Uh, one would have to do with uh, capacitating the core partner for Francophone Africa and for the donors and all the people who support the work of Afrobarometer on the continent, we will also ensure accountability to these teams and, and organizations and individuals. We will continue to provide any needed support to engage the relevant stakeholders on the continent, government, private sector, CSOs, so that the voices of, the, of people who continue to participate in the rounds of survey that Afrobarometer engages in are heard and that their voices do count in policy decision making. My name is Eduka Kradjaedi, Data Quality Manager for Fieldwork. I'm Enwe Chinguete, um, I'm the Deputy Director of Survey. We deal with first hand data collection. Our goals for the survey unit in 2025 is to complete 12 countries in the first half quarter. Additionally, we also have a couple of goals that are planned for 2025. We're looking into preparation for around 11 survey and a couple of activities that are lined up. My name is Jason Owen and I'm the Capacity Building Manager at Afrobarometer. As the Capacity Building Unit, um, we would like to build on the work that we did in 2024. Um, to work with journalists and civil society organizations to improve their capacity to use Afrobarometer data to drive uh, conversations and policy making in, in their respective countries. Um, we also plan to work more with uh, universities 
and students. Um, we have uh, the Summer School 2025, the English version, which is happening in January, uh, which we're very excited about. Um, and we're also going to have a French version sometime later in the year. And the final component is then making sure that this data reach the right people in the right format.